Um, today we're going to uh, demonstrate donning or putting on the appropriate PPE required uh, for an Ebola patient. These, this PPE actually exceeds CDC guidelines. The PPE is water impermeable at all levels and it covers all skin. In other words, there are no openings. It, she is totally encapsulated. What you've got to understand with this PPE is, is that this PPE is designed to keep people safe. It is not designed to keep people comfortable. It gets very warm in these suits. So what you're doing is, is right now they're, they're inspecting the suit, making sure it doesn't have any holes or any rips, tears, or anything out of the ordinary. Our PPE process will actually involve three people. You've got the person getting in the PPE. You've got what we refer to as the buddy, because we always use the buddy system. And we also have a third person who we've labeled as the observer. And this is the person who's really kind of in charge of everything, making sure everything is safe. So we've rolled the outer layer over, and we're taping it. The reason why we're taping it, we create a seal. We create that seal so no, no body fluids or anything gets through that suit. That is job one. We take that very, very, very seriously. Typically, donning and doffing, what's putting on or taking off this PPE, it take anywhere between 25 to 30 minutes. Speed is not a good thing here. You make sure everything's done very methodically. And there you go. And, and is the white PPE first layer, is that all plastic? Yeah, it's water impermeable, water impermeable tie chem suits. It's, it's basically a, a, a version of tie chem, but it's water impermeable. And it's, it's very warm. You okay? Yeah, I'm okay. okay.